hello my people who are following god's purpose yes are you doing hope you are doing great so god wants me to share this wonderful message with you <laughs> he wants you to wait on him yes wait on god <laughs> we can get ishmael or we can get isaac <laughs> like <laughs> i can pick any man in my DM and marry him and be miserable for the rest of my life or I can wait on God's man for me and marry him and laugh all my life hmm. the question is do I want Ishmael or Isaac hmm. another thing our relationship with God hmm. do I want to lose my relationship with God hmm no 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 i don't want to lose my relationship with god i'll rather die waiting and keep my relationship with god than rush into the wrong marriage and lose my relationship with god hmm. also this decision can play into every area of our lives if you are trying to make a decision on something it can be anything life marriage career jobs business house or anything are you going to listen to god or are you going to listen to yourself or the world hmm. listen to god and have peace or listen to yourself or others and be miserable hmm. it is decision time we need the holy spirit only holy spirit knows what is good for us that is why we need to sit down and study the holy spirit god says holy spirit is our helper so sit down and say holy spirit please help me please lead me like the more i study about the holy spirit i read about the holy spirit i hear someone's about the holy spirit hmm, the more i trust him and and i will say holy spirit you know what you are doing Please lead me. Please direct me. Like we need to trust Holy Spirit beyond knowing. Like <laughs> you don't have to know tomorrow. As long as God knows, he will lead you gradually. Like I did not know how I will graduate college. But every day, God was guiding me. One day at a time. One second at a time. God was giving me the strategy one day at a time boom i graduated it was like a dream same for you what are you trying to fix like seriously what you are trying to fix leave it to god god has a way out the more you figure it out the more you get sick the more you waste time let god figure it out god knows our tomorrow god knows how to make us help us to be successful god has a way out hmm. god is a miracle working god god has millions of ways to get us out god has millions of ways to save us he will do exceedingly and abundantly above all we ask or think he hmm. will do what eyes have not seen yes have not heard neither has entered into the hearts of men god can do the impossible trust him faith is for the unknown if we know everything you won't need faith so trust god beyond knowing trust god in the unknown i don't know tomorrow but i trust god god who has saved me up till now hmm. It will save me tomorrow again. Stop worrying unless you will fall sick. I don't want to fall sick. I'd rather sit back and enjoy my movie. And let God handle tomorrow. Yes, because he knows what he's doing. Enjoy your journey with God. Yes, enjoy it. So God keeps telling me, don't worry, I'm in control enjoy your movie i'm in control when i need you to do something i will tell you but for now enter into my rest 
be still and know I am God. What about you? What is God telling you? Listen to him today. He knows better than you. Do you want Ishmael or Isaac? Hmm. Take Isaac, wait on God, and you will laugh in the end. But if you take Ishmael, if you make Ishmael decisions, hmm, you regret it for the rest of your life. Wait on God, walk with God, chat with God, rest in God. He knows what he's doing. Amen. Praise God.